about 7 million Indians are working in the Gulf area, unskilled, semi-skilled, skilled, highly skilled, and sending billions of dollars to India. So there is a social breach, there is a cultural breach, there is a philosophical breach, there is an economic breach, now increasingly there is a political breach. In a few days' time, our Prime Minister will be visiting the region yet again. And he visited uh, UAE recently. So, because of this connection between the two, this language study and the literature study yes, is extremely important. Why? Why should we study literature? First, it can entertain us. Second, it can educate us. Third, it can allow us to understand people speaking that particular language and facilitate our interactions with those people. And if that is the case, I'm really surprised that nobody from School of International Studies is sitting here. Or if you're there, please raise your hands. Maybe a very limited number. In order to understand a society, a culture, and interact with them, studying literature is extremely important. I'll give you just one example, because time is short, I'll give you one example how, when I was doing my research, I studied not only the literature and songs, but also cartoons and even humor. And how people who write poems or essays or short stories or novels, all those things, if you see from the critical point of view, you know, those who are the critics, art critics, literature critics, they are different. But all those things come from within. And those are partly reflective of what is going on in the society, and partly they can change the society. So in order to understand and interact with the Arab world better, there should be a marriage between those who are studying politics and foreign policy and those who are studying literature. So I'll conclude.